ask myself so many questions Just why you always on my mind Always on my mind Just why you always been so good to me Could have been real I found someone so special to me Could have been real for the rest of my life the rest of my life Could have been real I found someone who cares for me And kiss you all night long, all night long, all night long, all night long, all night long. Oh, 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 yeah. Sweet love. Oh, 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 With me together forever living good eternally i'm hoping it is i want you to have both of my kids there's no need for child support cops and courts taking the shorts fully dedicated to mine you said you need a good man i hope i made it in time before you go changing your mind and doing something different let's make it official and keep the haters at a distance could it be real i found someone so special to me could it be real for the rest of my life Hi, this is Todd Ache, and uh, I'm sitting here with uh, William. Waka Paisi. Waka Paisi. Yeah, popularly known as Waka Paisi. That's right. I'm sorry. Oh, that's and uh, we just got done with the show. How do you feel? Oh, I feel good. I was really excited about today and uh, very much wanted to, you know, give something to the people. You know? I was kind of like in the mood and I uh, very much wanted to share, you know, kind of like music to me is a form of expression that I you know the way I feel, you know, about life and you know, sometimes try to express it through music. So it was a good moment at the same time having a good time in a club and at the same time trying to, you know, put up a performance and that was really great. I was so excited about that. And I'm just looking forward to more projects and just doing more in the music industry. Well, can you tell us a little bit about the song and uh, what the lyrics are about? So the lyrics is you and me. Uh, basically, talks about a relationship. You know, now you know people say love is so hard to find. True love. I mean, I mean love. You can get it anyway. But a true love is so hard to find that uh, sometimes you have that desire that you can just have somebody that you can really you know kind of like run away. You know, just sure. forget about the rest of the world and just you know you and me. That is uh, the title is you and me, and it was kind of a bit jazzy. Now, was there was there a girl that was involved in this? Yeah, I mean, of course, there've been incidences. <laughs> Most of the time, you know, the way I do my music is uh, I go through experiences, and sometimes it might not be, but particularly, it's this is my own emotions, my own feelings. Sometimes I feel like you know. I need to be with somebody uh, that kind of like I can get involved emotionally and then we can just be there with you know just in harmony without having any conflicts and just you know be the two of us in the in a land of fantasy uh, where, you know it's, it's <laughs> it great is. but uh, you know it, it's, it's always been like that I've always wanted to you know I mean surely you know love is such a good thing and uh, I've always wanted to have somebody that I can be share with and uh, and spend some intimate moments together. So uh, that song is about that, you know. And um, um, I wish. To Where do you see uh, your, the direction of your music going from here? Well, for me, it's um, mostly. Uh, I think it's all about the direction I'm taking. Is basically, it's the easiest part about the music that I do. Is is what I feel.
and uh, what I feel sometimes is the direction of I feel like I gotta go in a certain way and uh, I very much want to be um, become a producer I want to be a music producer to be able to help other people and right now I'm kind of like working on a project doing a showcase to look for people who are talented you know there are so many people that are talented but you know being an artist there's so many obstacles you know monetary aspect of it people don't have the money so I want to be able to start up that kind of a project where I could start like showcase so we could you know bring people that are talented together and you know kind of like do the networking with people like you know music and film you know executive you know a and dara people so we could bring this talent so that you know other people in other businesses could see you know what these guys are about so that's what i'm doing so basically i mean by myself you know i always write music every day is a song for me i think you know i always create and uh, but i, I want to move more towards also helping other people i want you know, there's so many people that are so talented and sometimes if I could be of any help so I could get with other people that are willing to you know put some shows together so we can look for people that are talented and uh, we kind of like give them that exposure they could market themselves and you know expose themselves and you know make money out of their talent you know if you have a talent you're gonna make use of it you know, so that's what I'm trying to do. You know, it's it's like it's so it's so, it's hard sometimes. You know, there's so many obstacles, and um, music is not really. Um, you know, especially coming from where I'm uh, coming from, Zambia is uh, music is not really like a money making career. So to kind of like choose that path, of course, man, I had a lot of uh, bad situations where you know I couldn't actually even like dead somebody because my the music is not a money making career so you definitely if you say i want to do music people think you're crazy you know <laughs> you know how, what are you going to do about income or something like that because people don't make money it's just a talent but you know you're taking a big risk it's a big saying, risk yeah. but you know life is a risk itself and i say you know if i have something that i have to offer to the world that i feel like i'm talented i have something that i can give to the world you know it doesn't matter to me the obstacles that are my way. I can always find, you know, that's the reason why when I did that, I had to produce some music and everybody kind of like saw that I really had that talent and I could, you know, make something, you know, monetary value out of my talent. So I decided to leave Africa to go to the United States, you know, to I went first to England, you know, I did, uh, you know, went to some recording studios I met up with uh, you know people from Soul to Soul, Jazzy B and all that and uh, and then I did my CD mastering down there but after I finished you know see I still wanted to come to America because uh, I mean you know it's, there's so many things you can do you know is America is for people who just want to go the skies all the way, the all the the way. and uh, I'm here man I'm here I'm in Hollywood and uh, you know, I'm just I'm doing it I'm just gonna do it. Yeah, well, we got a I'm we got a good uh, yeah. <laughs> performance out of oh, you yeah, tonight. Oh yeah, yes, I'm doing I think it. I'm, you, I'm, your show is rocking, I'm, and uh, you know I you, wish you the best of luck from here on out. Thank you. Thank you. It was you. a pleasure uh, working with you as well as uh, watching you perform tonight, and you. definitely you had the crowd going. All right, thank yeah. you. I appreciate that. You know, so, so uh, very uh, energetic, and uh, you know your moves. Thank you. Good out there. I appreciate that. Yeah. I appreciate that. You know. It might be nice to have a little female counterpart. Oh, definitely. I mean, oh, yeah. I, I know what you're talking about. Such a lovely so, song. You no, know, the know. song is about yeah. a female. I mean, I know, you know, but sometimes it's just that, I mean, I do. The message is there and, uh, and um, you know, very much wanted to it's always good to have a female in that but the message sometimes women just want want to get the message and uh, sometimes i do it that i can i can get down you know i mean i can handle that pretty well. <laughs> <laughs> you know but I, I mean it's like well, sometimes it just comes a time when like when you just want to put your message across and that's what i was doing but you know i, I mean I, I can handle the chicks you know just hey i do this for you because I love you, I care for you, okay? <laughs> there you have it, folks. <laughs> and uh, till the next time, uh, we'll see you again. Uh -huh. This is uh, Tata Che with...